Today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to select the right tripod. A tripod is one of those must-have tools that you need to start making better quality videos. My name is Rachel Dunn from Girl Director. And if you're like me, I always have this tripod kind of wrestle every time I want to video something. Even with all my video experience, I still find a tripod can be really frustrating because I'm a very visual thinker. And when I think about the shots that I'm doing, I'm always wrestling for which bit to put up because I'm actually thinking about the shots. Now I know that hover tripods are going to become mainstream soon, but until they do, here are my top tips when looking for the perfect tripod. So the first thing that you wanna notice between a photo tripod and a video tripod is a thing called the head. And that's this part at the top. The head is the top of the tripod, and this is what you will probably more likely pay the big bucks for because the bigger and more smoother the head at the top and the tilting function, the more that you will pay. Number two, make sure that your tripod isn't too heavy. Otherwise, you won't want to take it around with you. Now, this is a small little tripod that is really light. Otherwise, you won't want to carry it around or take it on holidays. Take it from me. I've traveled around the world with a heavy tripod to film a documentary. And I'm telling you, if there was such a thing as a really light tripod, I would have had one in my case. The lighter, the better. Make sure that your tripod can go as high as you, if not higher. This is a mistake that people make because if you're like me, I like to have the tripod a little bit higher than me so that you can point down and it actually gives me a slimmer look. Don't tell anyone. You definitely don't want to be shooting under the chin and everybody has a really good side they prefer on camera. So if you do have a short tripod, just grab a chair, sit or bend down when talking. You don't take your expensive tripods on the sand. You will have grit and sand inside the mechanics of the tripod. So make sure that you don't do that like I have. We love the Manfrotto brand tripod because they have a really good range of tripods to suit all budgets and a quality product to last you through all those rugged conditions. So I hope that's helped you decide what to look for when buying a tripod. So check out our reviews on this channel and I'd love to hear from you what kind of tripod you enjoy using or if this information has been helpful, please share this video. See you next week.